Dạ cái nghề này nó khó khăn lắm chị Đòi hỏi phải phải yêu thích yêu nghề Đi cái nghề này là vất vả Thời gian đồ này mình phải, nhiều lúc mình cũng có chủ động được Dạ Cái khi mình mua đồ nhiều mình chở đồ công tay lắm Chở đồ nhiều lúc mà bị ngã xe luôn á Công việc thì vất vả nhưng mà cũng kiếm được ít đồng Đường nghề này mấy cô mấy chú hay nói là nghề mấy bà chai bao lắm Nhưng mà những đồ tái chế gì được thì mình cứ mua thôi Mình giúp được bảo vệ môi trường Plastics are everywhere. Every year, we produce more than 450 million tons of plastics. And every year, more than 20 million tons of plastic waste leaks into aquatic ecosystems, polluting lakes, rivers, and seas, poisoning our world slowly. Welcome to Da Nang in Vietnam. Amongst the nearly 150 tons of plastic waste being produced daily in Da Nang, less than 15% are recycled. The rest, mostly low-value single-use plastics, ends up in landfills or is burned, exacerbating environmental concerns due to its proximity to the ocean and damaging local marine ecosystems. Informal waste workers, like Ms. Nguyet, work in challenging and unsafe conditions to collect high-value plastics, but the lower-grade plastics, which make up a large portion of the waste, often go uncollected, further contributing to pollution and environmental degradation. To tackle these challenges, creating a sustainable circular economy for plastic waste presents the most promising solution, particularly in a city like Da Nang, where the need for effective waste management is critical to safeguard our marine ecosystem. At OceanWorks, we work with plastic waste collectors and recyclers globally and know how hard it is to turn mismanaged waste into quality resins in good business. The PWP partnership gave us an opportunity to validate the use of OceanWorks Impact Plastic Credit to help establish a new sustainable supply chain for the full plastic waste stream, including the lowest value plastic. Plastic with Purpose brings together three organizations. IDE, a US-based nonprofit that specializes in using market-based solutions as the administrative and technical partner. OceanWorks, a U.S.-based company known for creating a trusted and credible marketplace for recycled plastics across the world, and Reform Plastic, a one-stop solution provider supporting entities around the world with the collection and processing of difficult-to-recycle materials. The initiative is funded by the Danish government under its Danita Market Development Program. Since 2017, the DMDP program has supported 36 different commercially oriented partnership projects in 15 different countries. This includes the Plastic Repurpose Project in Vietnam. We are excited about the role that this project is playing in bringing new business and technology innovations that can be scaled and replicated for sustainable impact in Da Nang. The vision of Plastic with Purpose has been to cultivate plastic waste recycling as a profitable venture for everyone involved in the value chain particularly for local waste collectors and small recycling business owners, while reducing the flow of plastic waste into natural environments in coastal cities of Vietnam. At Reform, we're not only proud of being part of this meaningful project, but also proud of the achievements, especially the collector network. We now have supported over 1,200 workers, not only with providing PPE, but also with trainings, free health checks, and connecting to better and cleaner sources for the feedstock. Although the project now has come to an end, Reform will continuously support the informal waste workers and the collector network as a whole. We intend to scale it countrywide through the good experience we've made through this program. The Plastic with Purpose partnership has raised the income of the participating market actors by an average of 40% while also training them on responsible business conduct practices. The initiative has helped collect over 2,400 tons of plastic from the environment with business models like Master Aggregator, processing an average of 200 tons a month. Imagine a future where those working in the plastic value chain are valued, fairly compensated, and work in safe conditions. Cities become more livable and beaches stay plastic free. But the challenge is real. Only 5 to 10 percent of the 1.83 million metric tons of plastic waste produced annually in Vietnam is recycled. Da Nang is just the beginning. Together, we can drive this change. <laughs>